All right, guys, welcome to another edition of What's in the Shop Wednesday. My name is Matt, and today we're going to go through the shop, see what's all in here. Let's take a good look at the shop, see everything we got going on inside. Let's go. Alrighty, so before we go inside, let's start outside. Uh, to start, we have a Subaru Forester here. We did a partial front PPF to the hood and also the side mirrors to protect the car from any kind of rock damage or chips or anything that he might pick up on the highway or any daily driving. This is the best protection you can get uh, to have an actual layer of product between the elements and your vehicle. So like I said, partial front bumper or partial front hood. And we also do the side mirrors as well for all the front impact damage. And the next car in our segment is going to be this Mini Cooper. This is John's Mini Cooper. As you guys saw previously in some of our last videos, this Mini Cooper went through an entire color change wrap to a white pearl with some red accenting. Um, and another thing we did, if you guys have seen the top of the roof from our last videos, he changed his mind about the color on the roof. So we went with a sportier look, a compressed carbon fiber wrap on the top to kind of go along with these uh, fender flares he has on the side of the vehicle. So color change wrap, ceramic coating, window tint, full interior detail. Set up, ready to go on the road, protected and color changed. Now it stands out, it's a one of a kind Mini now. Moving along to the outside area prep phase, uh, we have a BMW X35i from BMW. Uh, the car came in here for a paint touch up that turned into a uh, hood respray because this little bit of the damage that was on the hood. So we have a respray on the hood and then it went through our decontamination, full detail process inside and out. So this thing is now outside curing. We're gonna get it all cleaned up, a final inspection, and get it back over to BMW. This Audi S6, it is here for a coating maintenance and a wheel repair. So that's gonna be next in the docket today. Get that thing all tightened up, ready to go home today. Uh, next thing over here, we have a Jaguar XJL. Uh, this is Robert's Jaguar. He brought it in uh, to do a consignment style uh, process to it. We're going to go give it a paint correction and a sport coating so we can get it all tightened up, prettied up, and get it ready to sell so we can move on to the next big bad thing. Next up on the dock is going to be this boat here. Uh, we're going to go through a full paint correction process to remove all of the oxidation and uh, anything else that looks a little bit chalky or a little bit faded on the boat. It's going to go through a full paint correction process. Inside is going to get detailed and buffed and polished on the inside. All the whites, all the flat non-skids. Every single compartment will be open, be full detailed. There was a little bit of mold that was happening on the top sides of all the seats. We've already killed all that mold. It's just a matter of getting it all finalized killed. Get it all washed and get it coated. You can see we are now in the big room inside. So let's turn around and talk about this. We have a E300 Mercedes. It's here for a dent repair on the fender. Andy has already gone through and done uh, the majority of all the metal working to kind of get the dent out so that there's minimal body molding or any kind of fillers that he has to do to get this thing to look perfect again. So it's, that's in the working stages right now. And then next up is going to be this Chevy SSR. I'm sure this is no stranger to you guys, paying, uh, staying in, staying tuned. Uh, this Chevy SSR is here for a paint correction. Uh, we got the paint back to being showroom quality. It's jeweled up. There's no fading, no oxidation, no scratches or swirls left over. It is now for sale on our consignment business. Uh, if you guys would like to see any more information about this truck, it was on our Sunday chill. Uh, recently, last weekend, on our Sunday Chill video. So if you want any more information or any more visual effects on this truck, go ahead and check that out. Uh, next in the docket is this Jeep Wrangler Rubicon. This is Steven's Jeep. Uh, Steve came in, dropped his Jeep off, got a paint correction and a bronze package uh, ceramic coating. So uh, it's gonna be protected now. The ease of maintenance, like I've talked before, is gonna be a cakewalk. He can take it off-roading, go mudding in it, have all the fun he wants in this Jeep, bring it back home, give it a quick hose off, a light wash, and it'll look brand new as it does here. All right, next up is Kyle C8 Corvette. As you can see, this Corvette is not your average basic stock Corvette. Uh, from the photos and the video footage, if you look at this thing, it's got major slicks in the back, a spoiler, a lot of engine modifications, straight pipe exhaust, things a beast. It's here for a paint correction and a full ceramic coating. 
So this thing can go to the track, do what it needs to do, show everyone its rear end, and show how it's coated. All right, next up is Justin's Mastercraft. I'm sure you guys, this is not a stranger boat to any of you at all. You've seen the show Siesta Key. This is one of the featured boats on Siesta Key. The boat is now brought back to us just to do a little bit of a revamp to the coating. It's here for its maintenance. Otherwise, the coating's gonna last solidly for a solid two years. Now that it's been here for its maintenance, it's got another two years of longevity to it. Not a stranger, it's a beautiful boat. Let's get it ready to go back on the water for some more footage. Ram 1500, we are doing a full paint correction and coating on this one as well. It's gone through the wash, the prep process, the iron X, the clay bar decontamination. So now comes the paint correction step, and after that, it'll get rinsed and properly washed to come into our coating room to accept ceramic coating. Okay, next up is the Range Rover SVR. This car is here for a quick coating maintenance for us to revamp the coating and take care of just a couple baby scratches that happened on one of his drive commutes. So take care of the scratch, revamp the coating, Send it on its way. Next up is this Lincoln Corsair from Mike. Uh, this thing came in for a full paint correction, a bronze coating package. So the paint's all been protected, corrected, windows are protected, wheels are protected, and the interior got a full detail as well to wrap everything up. This thing is now protected and ready for the road. Next up, we have Brandon's Ram 2500. It went through the paint correction process. It is now in here for a ceramic coating. On top of that, we also did a blackout package to his tail lights and third brake light, along with his side markers, and we also gave him window tint. We have Tom's BMW X5. It's here for a paint correction and ceramic coating as well. Uh, the ceramic coating package is a gold package. That's going to be four layers of 9H hardness, one layer of top coat. Along with that, it's going to be window coating, wheel coating, and plastic trim coating. All right, guys, so we're wrapping up this Aston Martin Vantage that you saw last week uh, with the matte blue wrap on it. Um, right now, I'm putting tint on the side markers to add to that stealth look. We are now in the paint protection film and window tint area. And behind me, we have a Porsche Cayman S that is here for a paint correction and a coating. On top of that, it's also going to get uh, paint protection film installed on the front bumper and the side mirrors to protect against any of that front impact damage that's going to happen on daily driving, highway commutes. So now that it's been paint corrected, it is now in here prepped and ready to receive the paint protection film. And after that, it'll get fully coated on top of it. All right, next we have this black Lamborghini Urus in our window tint area. It's going to receive um, Expel XR Plus, full ceramic window tint film. It's gonna be heat rejection, so everybody on the inside of the vehicle is gonna stay nice and cool. Even parked outside in the hot tarmac, you're gonna still be able to get into the vehicle and it's gonna be generally a lot cooler than your basic car or even with basic window film installation. And last but certainly not least, we have this Cadillac CT5V. It is here for a paint correction, uh, gold package, and it's also getting a front end PPF installation along with the side mirrors to protect against all that front end front end impact damage. All right guys, and that's it for What's in the Shop Wednesday. Thanks for tuning in. If you guys want to get your car in here and to get to the level of caliber and make them look like this, come on by, stop by anytime or call us at 941-773-9500 Ceramic Pro Sarasota. Thanks guys.